Hello mortals, I am Dark Lord Kaiser, welcome back to Punch Club, and we still have a broken leg. Because I, I've just... I'm be literally continuing straight on from where I have the previous one, so... Leg's still broken, which means working out our legs is going to be less effective. I'm guessing this number over here says that that's going to be a, in case for four days. Not working out on our legs... These will still go up, I think, is going to go up, but uh, slower. So it might be worth just spending the next few days just focusing on getting our money and stuff. Can't even speak to Mr. Y. Oh, I can't walk around and do nothing. Can I kick a box or a thing? No. Can't even go over there. Okay, I don't know what I'm messing around with over here. So I have eight. Wait, do I have a... Uh, dodge and block are about, are about the same uh, energy rate at this point. What's that? Well, that's uh, take my energy down by four if I get that thing. Is it agility dependent punch though? And since I'm going for an agility build, might. Okay, so. Say so that's a five. It's a five damage. It's 100% accurate. But it takes a four energy to use that punch. Okay, how does that compare to what I've already got? So my high kick does five. I'm not going to worry too much about the accuracy, I think, at this point. I'll just ignore that for the moment. So that's five damage for two energies. That's five damage for four energies. It's not worth it. For a slight boost in... Inaccuracy For, to make it twice as energy inefficient. Not worth. I don't think that's worth it. What about the low kick? Right, so my high kick does five damage for. T I'm going to try and memorize all this stuff, and that's what's going to be my greatest failing, I think, at this game. Five damage for two energy. That does two damage for one energy. What was my other kick at? Three damage for one energy. So. Yeah, I think our current setup's probably the best I'm going to get. But, if I buy the backhand high punch, that'll open me up for these ones. And if I buy the rice eater, I could buy the way of the tiger, which is the, uh, the one I think I'm trying to go down. And I can start getting some kicks and get some... Yeah, I think once I start going down this way of the tiger route, then I can get some better um, damage to energy efficient attacks. Yeah, that's what I'm going to do. Okay. Eh, I hate scrolling all across like this. It's so slow. So, we'll buy that. But I'm not planning on using it too much. Oh, and then I can get through to... Once I get where the tiger, then I can get a couple of perks. Oh, another active skill. I'm definitely going to want one of them. Long timer. Okay, maybe we'll... We'll look into that later. Let's, <laughs> I'm getting way ahead of myself, so I need to get... Nine more skill points so I can get the rice eater perk, so I can get the way of the tiger. Okay. Oh, right, you who. Let's... But I don't think there's much point in me doing um, much training for the next few days, so... Wow. <laughs> Kazurik, I just lost two fights in a row and broke a leg. I'm in a very good mood about that. <laughs> Alright, let's... Uh... Yeah, we've got the money. Let's take the bus. So we've got a broken leg. Don't want to walk on that. Right, well, I'm going to have to take a snack before I eat, sleep, or I won't be able to do that. Okay. Just just have a soda for now. Have a soda, have a nap. Get me a wee bit of health back. Yeah, I know you're hungry. The energy goes up pretty quick with sleeping, so... Let's have... Pizza. 
on that again, because I want to try and get this health. Health up, which I'm assuming sleeping. Why is uh, this? Oh, I've got to sign up for this uh, fight in two days. Okay. Okay, let's eat properly. We'll have a pizza as well. There we go, get my stats back to something halfway decent. All right, and I guess we'll go to work for a bit. It's having the benefit of having the, um, the gym equipment. Because currently I'm losing money and time just getting to and from places. Um, whereas actually if I can eat, sleep and train all in one place, it should be better time-wise. Ah, now I'm too tired, so alright. Let's, let's go to the sporting goods store. Um, we'll... I'm going to walk this because I want to just keep as much of my money as possible. Talk to proper. That's not a name. Proper. What are you going to tell me? Oh no, because I don't even get to talk to him. It's just, yeah, do the thing. Ah, now this is good. Showing me some stats for this stuff. So, if I save up to 150, I can get a small punching bag, which will be good for me. Blue. Or I'll get the treadmill for 200 later. Okay. So we want to get sort of 350 pounds and we can get both of them. I say pounds, it's clearly set in America. I don't know why I said that. But I'm a sleepy man, so we'll we'll walk home. I'll save all my money for now. Go have another nap. I kind of wish they had like dream bubbles popping up above him for this, because that would be quite... It's something to watch rather than just watching all these little grey tones running around. Okay. Let's get a decent balance. Go back to back to the old jackhammer. I've got 100. Wait, didn't I need 150? Oh, whatever. So there's a fight going on today, but I want to earn some money. Okay. If I go to here now, again, we'll walk it. I should be able to afford a thing. Could I have afforded that last time and I didn't notice because I'm a dumbass? It's entirely possible, but I, th I don't think I could. Whatever, I'm gonna get it. So if I save it another 150, I can get the treadmill. But it's nice to see these stats broken down a bit better. So if I got Wing Chun, then I could go for everything a little bit, but going for one of these means I can just really go for the uh, the specifics. No, I guess it's a fight day. Um, well, I might as well go back to the Rocky League. Bob Dredson. Did I fight you before? I honestly can't remember. Uh, what was the... Okay, I'm going to switch out. I'll just make I want to try. I want to try it. Right, I'll switch out. Kick for... This high, uh, what was it called? Backhand high punch. I'll see how it works for the first round, and uh, if our energy is dropping way too much, I'll switch back to the other thing. Do, 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 do. Let's make it go really fast. We don't need to hang around this too much. Let's look at that stats. So his energy is still dropping faster, and his HP is going down more. So yeah, seems to be working for us thus far. Well, I'm liking the look of it so far, so we'll try again. Yeah, we're just taking this guy apart, aren't we? Yeah, he's, he's down to 2 HP. Yeah, I think we've, uh, we've got a decent setup here. And switch back to 1, just because. Why not? We'll, we'll savour this. There we go. Uh, let's see. So my health is this one. You can see my health barely goes down at all. There's just plummets, particularly in that second round. Yep. 
Good, good. Oh, it's this guy again. It's our friend. Are you going to take us back to the bar and we can meet a strange man who starts talking about... Um, what was he you talking about? Self-destruction. Yeah, let's do it. I didn't. I wasn't looking at what he said because I was checking Audacity was recording. Oh, your sister's returning from college and is a smart girl. Stop around your place some time. Are we going to meet your sister? Is that going to be the love interest? Is that where this is going? Roy is a good guy. Uh, no. I've got a broken leg. I ain't fighting her yet. Another ultimate fight. Let's see. Hey, I found Roy's house. Uh, let's see. I need to buy more food, don't I? Because all I've got at home is a bin burger. Right, let's stock up on Moo Cow Delight. And pizza. What the hell, let's have a soda as well. May as well burn all of our money. So, let's... We can't take the bus anymore. Yes, what is this about? Don't... You've not been very clear with this thing yet, game. Well, I kind of have to walk it now, don't I? Hey, Doc! You look sad. Is so is Doc this guy's name, or...? Hmm, I think I smell crime? Someone has stolen your laser? Uh, I... what? Who could stoop so low that's still from a scientist? Did you call the police? Let's go to the top one. Alright. I won't say that there were some guys wearing animal masks. Okay, we're hearing about these animal mask guys again. Now he's acting, did you call the police? Hmm. Don't want, <laughs> I don't want them to know I had a laser in my basement. Having a laser is not a pr problem. I've got a laser. I've got a laser pen somewhere. I'll put it down. I can't remember where. Hmm. It's very suspicious indeed. So that's a problem. Try and find and return your laser. How could you possibly know where it would be? Okay. Viewers, contrary to popular belief, having a laser is not a bad thing. It's all about what you do with the laser. I mean, you can set fire to things pretty easily if it's powerful enough, but you're more likely just going to blind yourself. I mean, it's not like you had a nuclear reactor in the basement. That would be a problem. But no, just having a laser... If, if you're a scientist, an actual one, and that's your, your job and whatnot, well, you're not going to keep it in your basement, probably. You'll have a, a laboratory somewhere. But, again, the police go around and you go, what's that? Oh, it's an optical laser. Are you allowed to have that? Yes, I am. Here is the power output. Here's the, um, the intensity the thing works at. Here's what I'm using it for. You don't need a license for it, particularly. I mean, it's not a smart thing just to... Yeah, okay, don't trust me on that licensing bit. I don't know what the rules are about owning high-powered lasers like that. But I was like, you can buy a laser pen off the internet, no problem. Okay, what was I doing? I was going... I was going, I was going to go to my house. I got distracted by green glowing briefcases with absolutely no context to what's going on with them. Except they appear to be reacting to some gang and animal masks. I don't know. Right, wake up, go get breakfast. I say breakfast is basically the end of the day at this point. But... So, let's see. Move out the light. Pizza. Soda. What the hell. Right. Now we can go to this room. And do some agility thing, which, because it's a fisty exercise, won't be affected by our broken leg. And all the 18th day. So, yeah, might as well keep doing that, why not? My skill points. How am I earning these? Am I just getting these through fights, or am I getting them in other manners I'm not picking up on? Okay, that's not doing anything anymore. Alright, let's do that instead. I don't know if this counts as your broken leg, because I suppose there's a bit of leg work involved in push-ups, but... Hmm. Oh, excuse me, viewers, that was, uh... You didn't need... <laughs> 
did probably didn't want to hear me do that, never mind. But, uh, well done now. Okay, can I... Why can't I call Frank? Why do I have to wait for him to call me all the time? Right, the most important thing we need to do now is go visit Roy. Well, I've only got one dollar, I'm going to walk it. Hey, Roy. Hey, fella, glad to see you. What's up? Well, I went to pick up my sister, but my car broke down. Dang, but that was a pain. Says the guy with a broken leg. <laughs> yeah, but anyway, I've told you, I've told my sister about you how, how great you are. Is that her? She looks nice. She's not really that impressed with the fighting stuff we do. <laughs> well, it's not to everyone's taste. But hey, you should go say hi to her. You're a great guy. Are you trying to set me up with your sister now? Meet Roy's sister, Adrian. I don't... Is... I've never heard of Adrian being used as a feminine name before. There's nothing inertly wrong with uh, it either way, but... Yeah, sure. I'll, ma I'll make sure to say hello. She stood right there. Okay, so we're going to talk tactics so we can train? Oh, okay, so we can join him in the workout. Okay, none of the workouts I've been doing thus far have really required a partner, but... No, I'm going to go say hi to the attractive redhead over here with the big bust. I mean this perfectly nice woman over here. Shut up. Oh, apparently Roy's always be calling me super cool. Fantastic. That's very kind of him. We like Roy. Roy is a nice person. Okay, I've met... You've met Adrian. High five. Unlike previous characters who get a mild description about their personality that he's somehow glimmered from the three words they've said to him, Adrian gets a high five. And that that's it. Not she seems smart, not she's funny, not I bet she could handle herself in a fight, or perhaps best not do any fighting around her. No, just high five. There you go. Did we say that already? I am Adrian, nice to meet you. Uh, nice to meet you too. I need to talk to Roy. Really? Why? Win Adrian's affection. <laughs> she is the love interest. Okay, how does one go about impressing the pretty lady? Don't know what to say. Better ask for. So, okay. Um, Roy. Chill. Go to what? Oh, that's just a chest. Okay. Let's, let's see what we said. Huh. Your sister is, how do I put this, rather attractive. It runs in the family. And hey, she's smart too. I wouldn't know about that. You won't let me talk to her. Let me tell you, I think she likes you. We're basing this entirely upon the, hi, my name is Adrian. That's the literal premise for the entirety of the conversation we've had with her. She likes flowers. There is a flower. Wait, is that... Is that literally the puzzle here? Do I need to go pick a flower from your own garden and give it to her? No, nope, apparently not. Okay. Hello, Adrian. Roy told me you like flowers. He's not wrong. <laughs> what kind of flowers do you like? So you're a fighter, huh? Sheesh. I'm interested in flowers. I'm collecting for... Oh, a herbarium. Nice. So, herbs. Her her the clue's in the name, buddy. I'd like to help you. Okay. Look for flowers in places you're visiting. Okay. I will search the city. There is a flower. It there we go. So I do need to give you the flower from your own garden. Hey, I found a flower for you. Did you see me go and get the flower? I am working hard. I need five more of these. <laughs> Fighter looking for flowers. Yeah, why not? Oh, wait, what's, th what's this thing? Am I going to start hitting his engine with a sledgehammer? That? What? Why am I doing this? This isn't... I'm not training doing this. This is literally just... Oh, I'm just being helpful. Okay. Now, I may not know much about engine repairs, but I think there's more to it than just whacking it with a sledgehammer. Oh, whatever. 
Um, well, let's see what else Roy says. Uh, chill, bar, ask about sister again, sex train. Well, I, I'm too hungry to do either of these things, so let's just chill. Oh, it makes me happy to chill. We're not talking, I'm just sitting there with a beer, staring at Roy. Staring lovingly into his eyes. So, we've got another fight tomorrow. God damn it, I'm going to have to remember to set my timer for these things again, because I still have no idea how long we've been recording for. But, I think we'll call that an episode as well. What have we done in this episode? It's sometimes when you record these things back to back, you lose all track of uh, what's been which episode. So let me think, we, we won a fight, we found a busty redhead, and we hit a car engine with a sledgehammer, which would in some way help. Okay, cool. Bye.